guys, it's Kerry and welcome to my little corner of the internet. Today I'm going to be going over some of my environmental science notes from my A-levels. I'm going to be using my environmental revision cards that I made throughout the year. There is a lot so they're not the neatest because I made hundreds. They have questions and prompts on one side and answers, diagrams and key facts on the other. The reason you can see different colour pen is because I use different colours for each topic or subtopic or subject just to make it easier for me to revise and get to a point that I needed to get there quickly and just to help me organise my notes. A tip I have for making successful revision cards is to not overcrowd them like I have. These ones I think might be from AS which was my first year of A levels when I wasn't quite as good at what I was doing and without a doubt as I progressed I found it so much easier to revise from short and sweet simple revision cards because the whole point is recollection and if you've written that much it's really really hard to recall that much information prompted by a single question. As usual I will be using GoodNotes 5 however I'm going to be using a slightly different key today Pink is for facts, blue is for definitions and statistics, and green is for examples. Examples are so important in environmental exams and they are what get you the marks and the top grades. Thank you.
Okay, now I'm just going to do a really quick recap over everything I just wrote out. I started with reasons to conserve biodiversity, such as using it for resources, medicine, biomimetics, which is just using naturally occurring structures to benefit and make our own artificial structures. Then I went over the genetic resources that we have from biodiversity and species. Biodiversity, by the way, is basically just the animals and the plants that exist on this planet. I went over about gene pools, like how climate change can affect crops, why we should grow crops, and that's about it really. I didn't do as much as I normally do because I've had a busy week, but thank you so much for watching anyway. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like it below and comment, subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you next Friday. Bye!